Hi, my name is Eric Felkel from Zygo Corporation, and uh, we're at Photonics West 2017. And we're going to talk a little bit about uh, doing surface metrology in adverse environments. So what we have here is our Z-Gage Plus uh, coherent scanning interferometer. It's a scanning white light system for measuring surface topography, texture, uh, all completely non-contact. One of the challenges of doing precision surface metrology is doing it in an area where you could have lots of vibration or turbulence. Um, wanting to bring metrology closer to the manufacturing floor, closer to the point of operation, is a common goal among precision surface manufacturers. And with the Z-Gage and the Z-Gage Plus profilers, we've introduced a technology we call SureScan. Um, SureScan is basically a way that we can eliminate a lot of the uh, vibration effects that can compromise the, uh, the metrology performance uh, for these systems. So measuring in uh, less than ideal environments is definitely a challenge to metrology. And a trade show floor is a great example of a lousy environment. It's noisy, things are vibrating, and to do precision metrology in an environment like this uh, is, is definitely uh, something that most people wouldn't expect to be able to do. With this instrument, basically all I need to do is tell it to measure, and what we're going to see is metrology of a sub-nanometer uh, diamond-turned optical surface measured you know, with people walking around, with the floor shaking. So I think what we've been able to show is that even in a lousy environment like a uh, uh, well-attended trade show uh, convention floor, with a tool like the Z-Gage and technology like SureScan, it's totally possible to do very precise uh, surface metrology. Uh, take this environment and you know, extend it to your manufacturing environment and really tools like this are a way to bring metrology closer to manu manufacturing floor and you know, really uh, shorten manufacturing cycles and, and improve uh, manufacturing processes across the board.